Arsenal have lost four of their five matches against the so-called Big Six. If lessons are learnt in defeat, then Arsenal manager Mikel Arteta has been rendered to a mere footballing student when confronted by one of the so-called Big Six. Aside from their disastrous opening day loss to Brentford, every single one of the Gunners' Premier League defeats have been against the very sides they aspire to be jostling with once more. Aside from their memorable 3-1 home victory against Tottenham Hotspur, Arsenal's record against the supposed Big Six has been disastrous this season. They were terrorised and pulled apart by Chelsea and Manchester City in August, 2-0 and 5-0 respectively, while Liverpool and Manchester United's respective experience shone through the Gunners however, there is an evident philosophy and prominent strategy within Arteta and technical director Edu summer arrivals Ben White, Takaro Tomiyasu, Martin Odegaard, Aaron Ramsdale, Nuno Tavares and Albert Samvilo Conga have all proved that they are stars of today just as much as the future. Their consistency against the teams deemed unworthy of forming a European Super League has been close to excellent until their dreaded visit to Anfield. Arsenal boasted the longest unbeaten streak in the whole division and were one of the informed sides Arteta's Arsenal reign appeared destined for the sack after their humiliation against Pep Guardiola's side, but he has miraculously turned fortunes around. There is no longer any reason why they cannot qualify for Europe or even displace one of the behemoths who normally occupy a top four place. However, the Shangri-La of the very transfer master plan Edu justified to Sky Sports cameras shortly after the city humiliation will not be mere top four qualification they rendered this summer's transfer window to a mere under-23 buffet, as they invested in some of the best prospects from Spain, Belgium, Italy, Portugal, and of course, England.